My name is Mary Fry, and I'm a sophomore at North Central High School. I am testifying today against Senate Bill 14, which allowed the carry of a handgun by various members of the government with inside the state capitol building. As a student that has recently studied our state's government in depth, I see no logical reason as to why the Attorney General, Secretary of State, State Comptroller, or Treasurer of State would need to carry a firearm with inside a government building. If the reason is personal defense, that is the whole state capitol police force's job. All of the people who this bill would benefit are members or have close relation to the NRA. I believe that this Senate Bill 14's sole purpose is to boost the authors, co-authors, sponsors, attorney generals, secretary of state, states controllers, and treasurer of state standing with the NRA. The time and funding spent on a bill that has seemingly no other reason but to benefit certain employees of the government is ludicrous and wasteful. My name is Mary Fry, and I hope that you take this into consideration. Thank you for your time. Mary, thanks for testifying. You're a sophomore? Yes, sir. Are you going to go to the Naval Academy? I'm taking it into consideration. Good for you. Um, here's what I would say to you. Um, you obviously are passionate about this, and you have a viewpoint of it that, by the way, I am not a human that is right, and you're not wrong. I have an opinion. You have an opinion. Uh, I hope what you take from today is that, look, not every politician, not every elected official um, has anything to do with the NRA or takes whatever they say. Uh, there are plenty of other, um, the Indiana State Pistol and Rifles Association. There's all kinds of groups that lobby one way or the other and plenty of groups that lobby on the other side of this. I hope the one thing that you can take from today, which by the way, uh, our country and our society needs now more than ever nationally and globally is that two people can disagree. They can do so passionately. They can do so vigorously. And then we can shake hands, be friends, and we can go have lunch together. Um, this politics has got to stop being a mortal combat 